Okay, so this is my airport um, attire. I have a um, two-piece um, workout set that I normally wear to work out in. And I just threw on a oversized jean jacket and I have some um, sneakers on. Um, these sneakers are so comfortable, so I like wearing them to the airport. Um, and then I have a black bag um, to carry all my little things in, wallet, etc. Um, so yeah, this is my look for the airport heading to Florida. <laughs> guys so this is the look for today's work attire so I have a green blouse um, that's a peplum blouse or a wrap top whatever you want to call it and some gray slacks and then I have these pumps here they're like clear black transparent whatever you want to call it pumps so yeah, this is what I'm wearing to work today. Okay, so I forgot to show you all what I usually do in the morning, but I usually make my iced coffee with the Starbucks iced coffee. I add caramel and um, some creamer. Um, so this is it here. I usually put it in my other, um, insulated cup but i left it at work i think so but look at what my niece and nephew made for me so cute i love it all right this is my lunch bag so i have um here this is a tea that my co-worker made for me my work mom so um i made tea last night and i had some leftovers so i'm just gonna bring the rest here I have an apple in here. Um, I have this um, tea, what you gonna call it? Uh, infuser. I bought some chips to snack on. And here's my lunch. So yeah, that's that. And then my purse. And I usually bring a couple bottled water. And yeah, that's it. So now I'm going to take my meds and I'll be out the door. So I've been doing a bad job with with vlogging. Um, so earlier I went to the pool. It was Memorial Day. Um, so I just laid out by the pool, had some snacks, drinks, or whatnot. And um, 
I had to go to Fossil because my um, Michael Kors watch is broken. So um, I have to take it there to get repaired and um, also go to the grocery stores. <laughs> guys so i am back from um running my errands i didn't make it to the grocery store i did make it to fossil and did a little shopping so i'll show you guys what i got um and um when i got to fossil they told me that they're not able to do any repairs there so they gave me a contact number to contact fossil um so that I can um, put in a ticket or whatever to get my watch fixed. So without further ado, um, I'm going to do a little haul on what I got from this cosmetic um, makeup store or whatever. All right. All right, guys, so as promised, I'm gonna do a mini haul on um, some items that I got from this cosmetic store. It is called the Cosmetics Company Store. So, oh my gosh, I'm so glad that I found this store. So they have a lot of goodies. Like, um, they have ma a high-end makeup brands such as Estee Lauder, um, MAC, um, Clinique. Um, they have Too Faced, Bobbi Brown, and um, other cosmetic brands such as the um, Origins, Clinique, um, and just a bunch of stuff bunch of other brands um and it's for the low yes for the low so like some items are 75 percent off um already marked down that um, on prices that are already marked down and then you get an additional 15 percent so you do the math <laughs> um so i'm gonna show you guys what i got so this here i got for free for spending a certain amount it is a soothing treatment lotion from Origins. Um, so when you purchase a certain amount, you also get um, this free um, cosmetic bag. And then you get six free samples. So I got a mascara from Too Faced. I love, love, love the mascara from Too Faced. Um, it's called Better Than Sex, and it is amazing. Like, I have no lashes. Like, my lashes are short, but like, when I use this, amazing. Um, this is Too Faced Prime Primer. Um, I got a Smashbox Primer. This is a Estee Lauder uh, Treatment Lotion. Another primer from Becca. And this is an eye cream from Clinique. All right, so that's that. My receipt, I'll let y'all know how much I spent. So this is the Estee Lauder foundation and um, the powdered foundation. So the, a liquid foundation and then a powdered foundation. I'm not sure exactly how much this originally retails for, but I got this for um this was i believe about eight dollars yeah so 978 and the other one was 914. y'all cannot tell me this is a steal like a <laughs> straight robbery okay um then i got Too faced foundation and powder this i believe was 17 this was nine about nine dollars so this is the foundation and the pressed powder as I mentioned, I love the Better Than Sex mascara from Too Faced. So I got two of these and it was $6 each. This is from Origins. It's a cleansing makeup remover. Um, I love the, the cleansing remover from uh, Fenty. Um, but I wanted to try this out because or Origins is a pretty good brand. And this, this was, I think, like $13. So I'm going to try this out. Again, I love the Origins brand, and this I personally tried, and I love it. It 
It's a um, active charcoal mask to clear, clear your pores. And it works amazing in my opinion. Like after you use this, like your skin just feels so refreshed. Like it's amazing. I love this stuff. And this was only $5. So got that. And I got um, this Joel Malone perfume. It smells amazing. Um, so yeah, I'm not sure exactly how much it retails for. It's like over a hundred. I got this for $44. So it was an amazing buy. So all of these things here, plus the perfume, which is crazy, I got for $131, $131. So yeah, it's a steal in my opinion because even with these two foundations alone, this was this would cost you probably over a hundred dollars. So it's crazy how I got like four foundations, all this stuff, and perfume, a Jo Malone perfume for one hundred and thirty-one dollars. So, um, if you want to know where I got it from, uh, I do live in Texas. So if you do want to know where I got it from, just leave a comment below, and I'll be sure to respond. So yeah, guys, that is my haul. Hope you all enjoyed it. Stay tuned for. The next video. happy saturday today is saturday june 4th um so i am dressed to go to pilates from pilates i have a um, pickup order i ordered some groceries yesterday so i'm gonna pick that up after and then from there i will most likely come home and just chill for the rest of the day really for the rest of the weekend um i feel like the past couple weekends i've been on the go so i really just want to relax and stay home and catch up on some uh shows on netflix and work on some things so yeah that's the plan for today i know i've been dragging with this vlog i haven't really been vlogging to be honest i i've been forgetting so um but today i will probably do a q a um a while back I asked my followers, I think my close friends, to send me some questions for me to answer on my vlog. Um, my previous vlog actually got deleted, so yeah. So hopefully I could do or answer some of those questions um, today and put it on this vlog for you all. So, all right guys, so that's the plan for today. I'm gonna try to take y'all along with me throughout the day um so yeah stay tuned So I left Pilates. Um, I had a very good workout. Usually I do level one, 1 1.5. Um, but today I did a level two, which was um, a little bit more challenging. Well, it's supposed to be a little bit more challenging, but I thought it was okay to be honest with you. Um, so yeah, it was a good workout. Um, so now I am picking up my um, grocery order. So I'm waiting for them to bring it out to me and then I will be heading home. And I have to go to um, another grocery store. Um,
y'all so here is my breakfast i have um what is that some maple chicken sausage um sweet potatoes roasted uh i have some eggs i put onions in there and cheese and i have um um what you want to call it multi-grain bread and my iced coffee so yeah that is my breakfast i'm having breakfast pretty late i am heading to dinner with um some of the girls from my pilates class so yeah um i'll bring you guys along with me to dinner um you won't see the full thing but you'll see some snippets here and there um i just hope it all goes well um this is our first time actually meeting up for like dinner and drinks and whatnot so yeah should be fun but all right guys so i'll check in later
guys so this is the completed look let me know what you think that was a pretty quick beat if you ask me you know the quick beats they usually be good and usually when i spend so much time on my makeup i don't really be looking how it comes out but like this was a quick beat and it turned out okay i like it all right guys so i'm gonna try this again um i had to speed through the makeup look because my phone cut off on me and um the questions that i answered didn't fully like it cut off on me so it's not really gonna make sense so that's why i sped through it so i'm gonna answer the questions here so um i'll start with why i'm doing this vlog um for those who don't know me or those who know me know that I'm a very shy person, um, so I wanted to do this vlog to, um, you know, get out of my shell a little bit, put myself out there a bit more, and to also improve on my communication skills, because when I tell y'all, like, I'm sh I'm a shy person, I'm, I'm really shy, like, it takes a lot for me to open up to somebody, um, so, yeah, um, but once I'm comfortable around you and I, you know, get to know you, feel your vibe you know i let loose you know i'm a uh i love to have a good time i love to laugh i love to smile i love to have fun so yeah um i'm gonna get right into the questions so i asked on my instagram close friends for my friends to ask me questions that i should ask on this vlog so um i'm gonna get right into it so the first question is navigating life um as a christian single woman in my 30s so i am 32 years old um and i feel like i am just now living my life like i'm finally like working in my career and um well i've always worked in healthcare. I've ha i have a bachelor's in health science and a master's in um uh health administration um so you know, I just feel like now I'm finally using my degree to, you know, an extent. <laughs> so, yeah, and I'm loving it, you know, like I'm just now living my life, I feel like, and I'm 32. Um, I'm finally on my own, like I've had roommates back in the day, um, but like I'm actually on my own own. I have my own place, pay my own bills, which is ghetto, <laughs> but yeah. So, and it feels good, you know, it feels good. So far, my 30s has been good to me. So I just thank God for that. Um, dating life. Dating life has been the ghetto, if you ask me. Um, those who are on the market know that it's a very ghetto out here. And I do not recommend. <laughs> Don't recommend it at all. I've tried dating apps and... Um, I haven't had much luck on there, to be honest with you. Um, I don't know, like, I don't think I'm the baddest chick, but like, you know, I feel like, you know, I'm a, I look okay, <laughs> you know? So I don't know why it's hard to go out on dates. Like, I really haven't been asked on any dates here from the dating app. Um, I feel like guys, they just, you know, want to text all day. They be like, you know, hey, what are you doing? How was your day? What are you up to? And it's like, my routine has not changed. I go to work, take my butt home. <laughs> like, are you going to take me out or not? Yeah, so are you going to take me out so we can get to know each other better? Because I just feel like, you know, when you have that face-to-face -face interaction, like, it's different. Like, you can see how the person acts. You can see certain behaviors. Um, you know what I mean? So that's very important to have that physical uh, connection as well. Um, and also on the dating apps, you know, if you do find somebody that you're interested in, you feel like conversation is flowing, they don't ask you out and the conversation, it just, it just stays there. Like, or they just ghost you, you know what I mean? They, they stop talking to you. And I feel like that has a lot to do with, you know, there being thousands of other women that, you know, they might be interested in. So, you know, it's become a cycle that I've um, noticed on the dating apps. So, yeah, I haven't had the best luck on there. So, um, I don't know if y'all got a brother, uncle, whatever. 
so yeah guys that's the end of my vlog thank you all so much if you made it to the very end thank you thank you thank you and um hopefully there will be more to come y'all let me know what y'all want to see in future vlogs if you like this vlog go ahead and um like it and subscribe and leave me a comment down below let me know what you like what you didn't like um and what you would like to see thank you so much for watching and i'll see you all in my next video